I've got a project on the horizon that requires me to mount a routing head to the spindle of my Tormach. In order to do that, I needed a bracket, so that's what I'm making here. It's a one inch thick stock, five eighths inch two flute, end mill. And here I'm just roughing out the hole for the Tormach spindle. And then over here on the right is the hole that the router is going to mount in. And since I have a CNC, there's no point in leaving it square. So I put what I found to be a pleasing profile around the perimeter. So that's the top half. Flip it over and cut off some of this excess waste before we fly cut the bottom to get it to the proper thickness. I'm using a V cutter here and as you can see there's two big V grooves on either side of this part. Those were uh, those were an accident. They weren't supposed to be that deep. They were just supposed to be marking an area for me to cut at when I put it on the horizontal to cut a slot there, but I guess I got carried away. And both sides of these are going to be able to be clamped. I'm going to put uh, square nut on the back side and just an allen screw on the on the front side and here you can see the recess for the allen screw and on the back the square nut not a bad surface finish at all and here you can see the uh, the V notch better that I'm going to use to align the horizontal so uh, let's do that now Of course, once I cut the slot in this side, when I flip it around to cut the other side, uh, it still has that slot there. So as you can, you'll see here in just a second, I had to I stick a parallel in that slot, the same width as the blade, so that when I tightened down on the vise, it didn't uh, deform it and squeeze it shut. That's it. She's she's ready. Let's let's mount it up and see what it does. And and here's the whole reason for it. The, uh, the 5,000 RPM spindle on the Tormach is is great for most things I do, but it's just too slow for wood. And uh, I need to make a wood pattern. I actually have a aluminum casting project coming up. And so you might if if you frequent this channel, you might see this wood pattern again. But I can run it a, a whole lot faster. I think it's a 30,000 RPM router. Um, it's a Bosch. I don't know the model number. It'll be in the description if you care. I'll have to look it up. Well, that's it. As usual, thanks for watching.